This afternoon, we're at the Homestead Miami Speedway. We're here for the DARPA Robotics Challenge Trials of 2013. We're here with 16 teams who've brought robots to compete at eight different tasks. DARPA is the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency. They are the agency at the Department of Defense designed to in, uh, introduce game-changing or breakthrough technology. Some of the tasks include a terrain course that the robot walks over that includes incline and decline and obstacles that it needs to walk over. Another task is where the robot is required to use a tool to cut through a wall and push a section of the wall out once it's cut through. Uh, an additional task is where the robot is required to turn three different valve type openings and closures. Some of the teams have received a robot prototype called Atlas. Uh, he is a humanoid robot, which means that he has arms and legs much like a human. Other teams have built their own robots as well as programmed them. The leader in the standings today is a team called Shaft. Uh, they are a team based uh, out of Japan. Let's head back over to terrain. IHMC is flat out rolling. Okay, I know, I know. It's a competition. You don't want to give anybody too much credit yet. But it's fair to say that right now, IHMC is having a very good time of it on the terrain task. eight teams will continue after the trials this weekend and they will continue through the DARPA Robotics Challenge finals in 2015. The team that is selected as the winner at the end of the finals in 2015 will receive a two million dollar prize from DARPA.